<laughs> okay, so you know if you've spoilers, mild spoilers, kind of spoilers for Thor: Love and Thunder, surprisingly. So that you know how in that movie they have the like the gag joke with the the his hammer where it just is you know how do you just like you know that was I did legitimately like that part and the idea of kind of anthropomorphizing the hammer and I I I don't want to get too in the weeds with that but I like that concept and I think it's relatable and I think that you know I don't want to speak I was going to say well we all have weird relationships with certain objects that comes out wrong. <laughs> but, but, yeah, your relationship with your, um, well, I was thinking instrument, you know, or but, like, a tool, or like a, you know, if you have a, a tool of your trade and you're always holding that and you have a particular grip with it and you know which one is your favorite and which one is the best and, you know, you take care of it and you, like, sharpen it and, you, you know, it has its own box or, like, you know, and, like, you don't want it to get damaged. You, you know, it's like you have, you, we have these, you know, um, you know, you it's like I want my favorite flathead cork, my favorite flathead screwdriver like no it's got to be that one like like we have these relationships with objects so like probably a lot of people you know with their with their with their with their this you know the the it, all the all the devices you know and having these in uh yeah relationship i guess with objects um but i no i liked that bit in thor love and thunder but yeah i <laughs> I don't have a, I wouldn't say, a romantic interpersonal relationship with this. This is it gonna, am I doing this right? But the little creep. No, it's not gonna work. Uh, I'll do that a different way, I guess. I don't know how to do the, the, the Love and Thunder thing. But it's sitting right there and it's staring at me and I'm looking at it. It, no, the, it, the, it, I've named all my instruments. I think this guy, I think I, I think I just did, well, I think I know, but, I think I just, I, I had, no, Gren was the saxophone, and yeah, Fido was the violin, but not named by me, but, you know, Fido was the violin, I named the sax, Gren was the saxophone, so I think uh, when I got to the bass, uh, I think I was, I just, it was like, Count Basie, like, cheap, cheap pun. But I didn't really refer, I was like, I didn't really refer to the bass by name, I don't think, too many times. Because I'm like, why? The name's not connecting with me now. Uh, anyway. But yeah, weird, complicated relationship. I don't know. That I'm a little afraid of, to be honest. Well... Oh. Yeah, more than a little. So see, see if I can joke and do, try to do the Thor thing. Yeah. Maybe I just called it the Ibanez. <laughs> really. The black base. The, well, you know, if there's only one for the most part, you know, kick out chair bit. Oh, yeah. I don't. I don't have enough room to, I don't have any room. I'm not in a good, <laughs> I'm not going to finish that sentence. <laughs> it's my left hand shaking, just touching it. Maybe, yeah, maybe, I think it's too much. 
is too much. It's too much, I think. It's, it's, a, it's a long time. Well, I was saying to myself a few minutes ago about uh, just ranting to myself, you know, that... I don't know. Well. It's been... You know, it's like, it's a... What was I saying? How did I put it? It's been a strange... It's a strange month for me. And today is a strange day for me. Specifically. And then... You know, there's a few more, and then, and then, for a few reasons, quite a few, and then, uh, and then I got sidetracked as I do and was off ranting about other things, but I think it was along the nature of how this idea of, Like, if you take grief specifically and you think about, I only want to experience it at this time and this place and this moment, and then we're done. <laughs> Put it away. And it's like, that's not how it works. But, like, we have how we have, like, Veterans Day and, like, Memorial Day, and this idea that, like, okay, well, today, today's the day that you do your sad thing and then you're done and you know or you, you know you you come back to it on the anniversary of and the anniversary of and then all the rest of the time you know it just it goes away it, it, but just that's not how that's not how emotions work you know and it can be with you every moment of every day but it can be it come it comes and goes you know and sometimes it just hits you out of nowhere and that's just the nature of it forever like you could be you know obviously it depends on the nature of the grief and how complicated it is and, and how traumatic and all sorts of things but I'm just thinking vaguely generally and specifically this idea of just it seems silly or absurd to just have like a like one memorial day as if it was only but then I guess the idea I guess the general concept behind having like one day or one date or one place or like one like physical building marker I'm trying not to say the word gravestone but like one place one specific place one specific time maybe that is individually or communally helpful for people to try to compartmentalize or tr or either just have have a f maybe it's maybe it's not about Maybe it's not, maybe the glass half empty take is saying, well, we want to pretend culturally that everything's fine all the rest of the time. And, you know, here is the time that you are culturally allowed to express whatever emotions, and then you got to shut it up again, kind of thing. That's kind of a glass half empty kind of view, but then the other, the glass half full kind of perspective, I think, is as a focal point, as a focus point, because, you know, all these things can be so everywhere and so diffuse, and you can't, you can't be, say, mourning and, like, trying to do your work at the same time that you have but you know and you have to compartmentalize and you have to take so it does help maybe to assign times and moments and places to things of like and you maybe you're 
your body brain thing isn't gonna follow suit be like you know it's just like we i'm in my bed with the lights off with my eyes closed so go to sleep now no like i'm standing in the cemetery staring at the graveyard feel sad now now is the time that you are allowed to vent and grieve go for it and then, then what do you like have a giggle giggle fest or something like you just it you can't force these things but at this you know you more than like it's like you're a more typical example i feel like it's like you're fine you're fine you're totally fine you, you know you're just walking and then you're just somewhere like maybe you're at work or you're yeah you're out out in the world and you hear a song on the radio and, and, or the the pa not even a radio just like the pa system and it's in the background and you can like barely hear it and you weren't you couldn't have weren't really paying attention to the music really because you're you're working or like you can't really hear it or there's a lot of background noise and there's a lot of chatter and there's a lot of and you don't even and then you stop and you're like is that that song oh wait maybe i misheard it or i don't know and then you just you hear the song and you're like oh and then it's like and if if you're if you're memory is connected to music then you then like it's like instant like oh you had to play that song today okay you know and then maybe your mind is or, or it doesn't have to be a song it could be you see an object or a lot of people say smell i don't know if i have i don't think i'm i don't think about that i mostly i think most of my memories are i feel like they're music based I'm sure there's more to it than that, like, you, th but yeah, you, like, maybe, like, you're, th you know, you see a, a can of soup on a shelf in, in the grocery store, but the, the color reminded you of just weird ways your brain is triggered into things, and then the next thing you know, like, you're just, like, you know, trying to curl up in a fetal position in the middle of aisle six like or not no maybe you're totally fine and you are able to just you know you go elsewhere to you know that's the thing is managing and getting by and anyway well like i feel like it's like, I don't want to say that I've been doing better this feel like, because it's like I jinx it. But I'm, or I'm not, or I don't know, I haven't really thought about. But it's just this, it, it didn't help <laughs> that a certain song not only has been playing at work on the PA, but that it seems to be like on a like daily common loop now, you know, like, every, you know, every, you know, so the past several days that I've gone into work, one of the songs on the like six that I'll hear over and over and over again, it's like, no, stop, you know, and so I'm trying to like, you know, I'm not going to like tip my hand, but I'm just trying to like, I have to like try to laugh it off or something. You know, and then it didn't help, too, on top of all the other things that are, you know, like I said, strange month, strange year, or, yeah, well, that, that too. Not like there's nothing going on in the world. Uh, strange day, specifically today. Um, one, one year. Day. It's strange. Very strange. Anyway. But it didn't help. It didn't help well, that I was at work and there was a customer named Sally. Yeah. It's not a common name, thankfully, so I don't hear it that often. Which is why when you do hear it, yeah. Anyway, so then I'm, and you, you know, it's like you have to have that whole customer service smile, you know. And that separately is just a separate 
whole other thought of <laughs> how can you be authentic and genuine and not disingenuous but you have to guard yourself and you can't be your real self around like say customers but you can't you don't want to be inauthentic but you but you, you so you walk this line but then even if you are being real and being authentic to a point you know if you're just that's the whole thing like even you know even just like with the the like if you're in the middle of shopping and then you're just triggered by something and then right there right in that moment when all you want to do is just ball your fucking eyes out you can't well you could and you know will have and had have done now past present future tense but but like you're not supposed to culturally and then you you know how do you have a nice day like how do you get out of that moment I guess it goes back to what basic survival instincts of, like, don't show the predator that you're wounded. But then you have to process it at some point. And then I guess it's a matter of how and what the coping mechanisms are and how it's processed. And, yeah, that is very complicated but how i guess the optimal thing that the utopia optimal thing that everybody's trying to do is that it's not about not feeling bad it's just and it's very appropriate at times it's about uh well, everybody says waves, waves. I suppose I like waves better than roller coaster. <laughs> but I guess, but um, I guess the general sense is I'm, I'm like nervous picking. I guess the general sense is is like you want to like you know come up, come down, come up, come down, uh, come up, come down coast it, ride it, surf it, you know, yeah, just, just come up, just, just come up, just, just, just do that, just, you know, just, you know, just, like, just, <laughs> this thing, it, just get away from me, <laughs> but it's just, uh, yeah, I don't know, you know, <laughs> No, it's just lots of things I'm thinking about, but I'm also thinking about nothing. Anyway, then there's that. Well, it's just, you know, I've been kind of enjoying sing karaoke stuff. But I'm not a singer. I never tried to be. I never pretended to be. I just... I needed something... Some kind of baby step way back. Or... Just... I don't know. I don't know. Some... It's... I'm deconstructing my brain. And trying to piece it back together again. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. But I have complicated relationships with this individual that I have neglected I wouldn't say abused well back in the day has my blood on it blood sweat and tears I don't think I ever did wash it off not like not in like some creepy way no you know like you're oh, fuck, I'm gonna hit things I'm gonna hit <laughs> you uh, my obviously my stupid little room is not even optimized I hadn't even thought about that like co whack obviously <laughs> no but yeah uh, this feels weird which is sad and wrong 
and I hate my chest, which is a whole nother story. No, here! Uh, eh, eh. Bridge. Uh, that's not cool either. Here, because you play to you bleed, and then if you've bled your... Was it my thumb I sliced open? Probably all, you know, you have to, you're not a musician until you've broken all your fingers. But like, yeah, and then there, you know, it wasn't like profuse, just sprinkles. But, so there's some little microscopic little sprinkly droplets of blood on the black under there. Which, yeah, fuck yeah, I'm not washing that off. This is my, this is my baby. This is my baby. And I got <sighs> major chest dysphoria too i don't want to talk about it but anyway um so i this and it's not i don't even want to pluck it because it's not even in tune oh i have i have one other base which is quite the beauty but i can't like it because of various reasons. But even just reasons aside, I would never got acquainted with it. I never got to know it. I never got to meet it. The other base, the the Hagar, the uh, Hag Hagstrom, a beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous base that if I were worthy of it, which I'm not, <laughs> You know, it needs it needs a more worthy home. But there was a point at which I had once dreamed of being worthy. <laughs> but no, I don't have an emotional connection with the the Hegstrom. I don't have it. Just it's a stranger. I've never met it. This guy, Count Basie, feels like the wrong name for you. But I don't have a name for you, which is sad then. But the black, the black base, the base, why would you name the only thing you have, the base, I'll go get the base, yeah. I, we, haven't, I haven't, I didn't even want to look at it. Not, it's not you, it's me, it's not you, it's me, ah! <laughs> I'm gonna break things. It's because I can't do shit anymore. And I never could, but I used to think I was a little something something when I was younger, and I used to love it. <laughs> I was never great. I think I was just, I was always struggling to find my niche, niche, niche place. Um, but... Anyway, anyway, I just can't, you know, it's like if you've forgotten how to walk, you never want to see your shoes again, or something, you know, you don't want to find out how bad you are, and you know, maybe every once in a blue moon, I'd take it out, it'd been a few years, and tune it up, and like nothing would come to me, and play a couple of notes, and realize I suck, and put it away again. Every once in a blue moon, every once in a blue moon, I feel like I did a really cool tribute to Bowie, when Bowie passed, and that was a fun day, um, and I actually did some bass teaching, which never happens. So that was a good moment. But, what was the line from the song? What happy hours I find are so few. Something like that. I can't, that song is too much. Anyway, this guy, well, if anything else, it needs to either be tuned or to have the strings drop down so that it can preserve it a bit, right? Because they're still tight, which is not good bassy care. 
they needed to have been. Well, periodically I would, but I just, they're tight though. They're too tight for having been stored. Okay, well, I don't have room, but first things first would be to tune it. And I don't know if I want to admit that I don't remember notes anymore. <laughs> well, I think I do. I just don't know. I don't know what I don't know. Oh, it's going to be so terrible. But yeah, where, where are we at? Nothing's bleeding, nothing's broken. Where are we at? Slightly. <laughs> no, I don't know. I was just thinking, well, no base of mine would ever be even slightly out of tune, even if it's been in storage for a century, because it's me, after all. But it is slightly out of tune, but only slightly. But it should have been lower, because that would have been optimal for storage, right? Well, I mean, it's y'all you know, are probably saying it's horribly out of tune, but you know what I mean. I mean, relative to each string. Just shut up me and do your thing and stop talking because that's all you ever do is talk. And you need to shut up and listen more, obviously. All right. That's the thing is I want to get more intuitive and less caught in my own head. Anyway, and I think maybe music has something to do with that because I only ever seem to be happy when music is involved <laughs> I mean now that I say that out loud that's true right yeah everyone I've ever known and loved was music related in some way Everything is music. I didn't, I was just, but it's all, I just mean, psychologically there's this concept of the flow or it's a meditative practice or like people might more colloquially know it as like getting in the zone. This idea that, uh, I think the article I was reading, which obviously woefully outdated, but it was on the flow, and it's a meditative practice for, like, cognitive behavioral therapy and meditation purposes, but, you know, the analogy of, like, a musician or an athlete, so, like, I think they were talking about a basketball player, and I think they were talking about a musician, this idea of, if you, if someone gets to be really good at something, where they're highly skilled, then they can be in the practice of doing that thing where they are simultaneously concentrating very hard and working very hard and you know probably really stressed and like concentrating very hard and intensely and um you know doing skills high level skills then at the but at the same time if i guess if you're like i don't want to say good enough but like if you're like into it enough you can also kind of like that's the whole thing is like get in the flow get in the zone where it can like to the player feel almost effortless or whatever and I think it happens a lot well my my key into that it would be like isn't that improv that's improv right like even like it's not about I don't think it's I think the paper that I read was talking about that you had to actually be an expert, that you actually had to be, like, you know, one of the best musicians. Of like, you had to be, like, an Olympic athlete, and, like, only people who were this skilled could achieve this level. And I don't think so. It's, it's, but I do think that some degree of skill is involved, or I think that it has something to do with concentration. And something to do with if you... Maybe muscle memory, too. Like, if you've done something long enough that you know, something that you know deeply to the back of your hand, like, I suppose it could be anything that you... The problem is you'd have to... It could be... Well, like, I was thinking, like, if you're an electrician and you, you had, like, a specific... You know, you, like... Like, I can... 
you know, I can I can rewire this 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 faulty switch in like like ten minutes and like just gimme give gimme give you know, gimme and you're in there and you're working on it, but you know you, you know what you're doing and you've so honed it over the years so well that you almost forget about everything else and you're only into that moment and it's only, it's not about being happy per se it's about being in the present tense that you are like i guess the most fully in the present tense i don't i don't, I don't know way 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 off track but it's just i guess it was this idea of how to help it had some, it, i don't remember now I just remember it had something to do with cognitive behavioral therapy. It had something to do with meditation. It had something to do with trying to, like, think about the present. And it had something to do with... But I think I was keying into it from how you can use... I don't know. You know, like, you use something like that or some way to... I I don't know where it's... I don't know where I was going. Fuck it. All I do is talk, right? All I do is talk. Talk, talk, talk. (laughs) Music man. Talk, 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 talk a lot, talk a little. Cheep, 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 talk a lot, talk a little. Cheep, 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 cheep. I used to watch that as a kid. Alright, fuck it. Let's tune you. I don't like that either. It's not bad. And I have no idea if the camera can pick this up at all because that's why it's not acoustic after all. I would love like, I always wanted to, back in the day, not now, but back in the day, I was intrigued by the concept of like acoustic electric. So you can have the fun of electric, but you can have the tone of acoustic. Well, there's all sorts of thoughts I had. Yeah, shut up me. I hate my brain so much. Anyway. Today sucks. <laughs> oh, uh, that's overly simplistic. Alright. It, did you, why do you keep plucking it? There's nothing wrong with it. I don't know. I'm thinking. I'm musically thinking. There's got to be a word for that. It's, yeah, I just didn't like you. I didn't like you. Yeah, no. No, because you're slightly off. You're slightly high. Oh, that's right. That's right. I tuned you slightly, slightly high on purpose, I think, because reasons I seem to recall. I don't know. My old ears. No, you need to come down. Fuck it. Yeah, no. But, yeah. This is thrilling stuff. Everybody loves a good tune. It's meditative, right? Mm-hmm. Nope, I don't like it. Nope. Mm-hmm. Well, you're all, you're old. When was the last time I restrung you, you poor thing? I have been keeping good temperature control though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. It could come down. Yeah, and tinny. It's tinny. I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know anything.
Yeah. Okay. All right. Fine. 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 I'm stalling. I've been stalling. The hard part is, what next? Okay. The very last thing I was listening to, Eagles. Not the choice I would have foreseen, but it was on the radio today, and now it's in my head. And I like it. Uh, I was just fucking singing it, but I've completely lost it now. Dirty Laundry. Do, 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 do. Now that would be that you need like I feel like you need synthesizers for that. But okay, fuck it. Let's see if off the cuff I haven't listened to it since the radio earlier, but I mean come on. This is gonna be absolutely terrible. You know, most people would like start with like you know, fucking twinkle. <laughs> I don't even like the strap. I don't like anything. I don't... If I could make my chest go away, that would be perfect. But, you know. Alright, fine. Fuck it. Alright. Anyway. What? A scale? No, 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 no. We're not doing no scales. <laughs> oh, fuck it. Twinkle. Uh, I, you know, I could do a song I used to know, but I feel like that would be not optimal either. And I don't even know what I used to know. Well, I don't want to think about it. Alright, well, I know one, but no, I don't want to go back into memory lane. Okay. I'm not doing my Sharona. Shut up, I'm not. I did go back to the other one. The da, 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 da. What's the bass part to Don Henley Dirty Laundry? Or what's the melody? Okay, what's the melody? What is the song? You just heard it. You are just thinking about it. What's the song? Da, 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 da. That's the only thing I hear now. Oh, I need to... Okay. Dirty. I need to look at the lyrics. I had the lyrics up here. I need to get... The, where's the lyrics? Hold on, let me get the lyrics. Okay, so I feel like the normal thing to do would be to do like a scale or like twinkle or like play a song and play with it. I think I should probably play Dirty Laundry, but I think I, because then I could hide behind it, but then I can hide behind it. And I maybe need to know just how terrible I am. No, that's the glass half empty version. The glass half full version. We're trying to see if I can remember anything. Or, no, that's not the point. This isn't like a skills test. This is just like, I don't know what this is. Okay, song. Dirty laundry, dirty laundry, dirty laundry. Dirty. What note does the song start on? Well, maybe I'll just sing it. Sing it and hold the thing. Hold hold the thing wrong and bad and then sing the sing the thing. Now, what was the note that I didn't want to sing it on? God, I think I need to hear it again. Cause now, I make my living off the evening. Just give me something, something I can. People love it when you lose. They love the laundry. This is such a fun. You could do this like so many different ways. I make my living off that. I don't know. I don't know what I want. I don't know what I'm hearing in my head anymore. I mean, I just heard, like, three different versions of the same people that, you know, Eagles, you know, I just heard three different versions of the Eagles playing this song in three different, like, it's just like, that's just for starters. <laughs> anyway, fuck it. I'm thinking too much. I hate my brain, okay? I need to figure out what things are. I'm overthinking everything. Alright, what am I at? 40 minutes into my ramble? 
Well, in 40 minutes, you got the thing in your arms, at least. I don't know if that does. This does not count. Yeah, 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 I know. How does one make noise? Oh, buzz. What does, oh, it's the two fucked up on the bridge. No, oh, I'm not gonna be concerned with this at this point. I'm an embarrassment to myself is what it is. I should know what causes a decent buzz. Eh. Fuck it. I don't even know what the bass part is. All I can think of is like da 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 I don't know what I'm thinking of. Dumb. Eh, fuck it. What I need to do is stop trying to force a thing and just noodle and wake, wake it back up. That's my lowest note? That's is that what I'm going with? I'm sure it's not like in tune tune. I just care that they're relative to each other. I could proper, but meh. I eat. I have a fucking tuning fork in the bag that's one foot from two feet from me. And that would solve everything. Because <laughs> I love using a good old tuning fork. So that's all you need. So I use a tuning fork. But then I'd have to like get, like get up, and that's stalling. You're just stalling. You're just stalling. Canoodle. I, it keeps. I keep thinking canoodle, which is a different word than noodle. No. Uh, no canoodling. Just. I don't know. Is there a command for fuck around? Yeah. Mess, 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 mess. That's terrible. Well, maybe I'm making it terrible. It just seems everything is wrong. I don't know. What is anything? It doesn't feel pitched right. It's still wrong. Yeah, it is. Uh, no, that's right. No, that would make sense that you would get it in tune. And then as soon as you play it a little, it would pop out. But that's, I don't know. No, I'm just wrong. Eh, fuck this shit. This is, this is what happens. I, I give up before I try because I can't even. I'm too lousy. I just don't like it. It's, it's fine. Just stalling. Because you just... Uh, you can't stall something that you don't have planned. <sighs> I just want to be able to get further than just looking at the thing. It's like, I know music comes out of it. I just, just, it's not capable of coming out of me anymore. Anyway, fucking life. I 
I don't know why that reminds me of something. <laughs> yeah, no, I can play two notes. Yeah. No. This is not right. I still feel it's out of tune, I don't know. I don't know why. Yeah, no. 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 Like Marisha said in that latest Critical Role video thingy. No. It is not right. Yeah, it should probably be higher too. Yeah, no, you know, you're bad. Thrilling stuff. Mm, no. I remember this. I remember my hard of hearing and yet completely dissatisfied, super picky ears. I remember this. It's gonna take me eons to tune something that everyone else thinks is perfectly fine and I'm still over there fucking tuning it. No, did I butcher you? I'm sorry. Nope. I just don't have what space I want. Yeah, I'm still stalling, aren't I? Alright. Yeah. Yay, I know I'm not plugging it in because that would make it worse. Alright. Yes, I can feel it. That's so, I don't know. Yeah, like, I'm not going to do scales. Fuck it, I'm not going to do scales. How do I warm up? Kind of approximating a scale. <laughs> you know, maybe everybody who teaches these things, maybe they know a little something, something. Maybe it's just, you grow up, you do etudes, you do scales, and you're like, I'm never doing this again. And yet, it's, I don't know, I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't like anything. I'm gonna do everything wrong. I'm gonna put my wrist up against the wood. I'm gonna only use one finger. I'm not gonna shift appropriately. I'm not gonna do anything correctly at all. No, I need better wrist because I'm not hurting my wrist. Uh, 
Yeah, it's n nonsense. It doesn't even sound right. I don't know. Wait. What was that song that just crept into my head? And then it just quickly disappeared? Yeah. What song is that? Da, 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 da. I'm not getting it right, but... If I'm on the fret, that means it's flat, right? Mm-hmm, it should be higher then. Not this again. Yeah, no, it should be. Boom. Mm. Don't judge any deer. <laughs> there you are. There you are. It's probably a weird way to do things, huh? Oh yeah, well, either I didn't get it right in the first place or it is pitchy and slipping out of tune, but if it was the latter, that would make sense too, because that's what violins do anyway. They don't, they're not going to stay in tune if they've been not played for a while. But it wouldn't put it past me to not have gotten it right in the first place. It's like, who, who fine tunes a bass? Basses don't have fine tuners. That doesn't make sense. That statement didn't make sense. I don't know what I'm thinking. Now it's flat. Stay. It's getting tight. Alright. It keeps going flat. It's, mm. Better. I need to stop with that. Wow, I'm an hour in already? <laughs> an hour in and I haven't done shit. Yeah, that, that does seem par for the course. Okay, fine. <laughs>